okay this is the city where I'm, I'm at at the moment okay you can see it on the on the sign here okay and this is the tanks the tanks that were used in world war ii okay two if you don't know okay um you know caused, caused by hitler okay these tanks that were used in the second world war had the same uh courses on the on the tank you know that sign of a course here if you see it all right so Putin says, you know, oh, these people are Nazis and things like that. That's why you fight against Ukraine, right? And actually, you know, okay, and actually these tanks were used in the Second World War. Okay. Okay, not just that they used the same cross sign on their tanks in the Second World War. Okay. But also they actually think about here on team in Germany, okay, to deliver um tanks to ukraine okay which is not a good thing okay these tanks of course have also a thing on it where they can shoot okay for but for transportation reasons they put it off so it don't fall uh, off, off the ground you know when they transport it so this cross is what putin sees as the nazi cross if you if you will because they used it in the second world war if you type in on youtube second world war okay tanks you will see that same course but some tanks some tanks even are the same just with a different name you know so of course basically the same tanks with the same course but just that course alone is enough to basically give putin a reason to say oh that's that's the nazi tanks you know or that's the nazi regime coming against us you know Can't double honors to the elders and apostles of Good Will Stone should warm also to the one that is for life, which includes the Shilas children as a good Negroes, Latinos, and Indians who are still oppressed together according to the book of Jeremiah 50 and 33, but him so lay pattern at the adoption, bringing of the law, the promises, the glory, the covenants according to the book of Romans chapter 9, if you don't know. Okay. And um, the video I was showing you is. Um, basically something which um, you know uh, you have people coming with these rumors of war you know I, I already saw another guy filming this not just me okay what the problem starts when you don't have this truth okay because you know you have I, I saw two minutes ago I saw an article so luckily I'm a little bit tired you know watching Netflix all day so to speak kind of like you know um and you know the problem starts <coughs> with these rumors of war and we'll read matthew 24 and 6 okay because there was somebody talking or oh, they or oh, putin wants to bomb uh, biden okay and you show here of wars and rumors of wars okay and this is a rumor until you know until really you know stuff of course will happen but you know with all the speculation stuff and whatever, you know, the Germans are the best in that, okay, talking 5,000 hours a day about things that, you know, what uh, they shouldn't be concerned of. See that you be not troubled for all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet gone, you see, because prophecies, prophet, prophecies has, have to happen, okay, and uh, these people talking, talking, talking without changing anything when it comes to themselves okay for example learning and understanding what uh, the bible teaches about the end and you know uh, where can we find all this what happens right now uh, you know answers to to basically everything what's happening okay seven for nation shall rise against nation and kingdom against kingdom and there shall be famines and pestilences and earthquakes in diverse places all these are the beginning of sorrows then shall they deliver you up to be afflicted and shall kill you and ye shall be hated of all nations for my namesake come this is so called jacob's trouble and we will read it Okay, and it's in the upper cliff about um, oh no, Salah.
Jeremiah, Jeremiah 37, Alas, for that day is great, so that none is like it even. It is even the time of Jacob's trouble, but he shall be saved out of it. Verse 8, For it shall come to pass in that day, said the Lord of hosts, that I will break his yoke from off thy neck, and, uh, uh, and will burst thy bones, and strangers shall no more serve themselves of him, but they shall serve the Lord their God, and David their king, whom I will raise up unto them. Therefore fear thou not, O my servant Jacob, said the Lord, neither be dismayed, O Israel, for lo, I will save thee from afar, and thy seed from the land of their captivity, and Jacob shall return, and shall be in rest, and be quiet, and not shall make him a fight. Come, you know, and you know, they do, so. They still debating and things like that, if they should deliver, I can show you that. Um, thanks to uh, Ukraine, but they're not sure, okay? Let's type it in. Does Germany deliver tanks to Ukraine? And of course, I even, I even, or I even wouldn't be w wondering if they do send tanks to Ukraine, but in the media they tell and show the people that they, w that they don't do it. Okay, especially not now. Okay, but I would not wonder if they actually already do it. And this could be a proof for that, but we don't know. Uh, September 27th. Um, let's get that off. Uh, September. Let's get that off September. Okay. Salah, I know I'm a little bit tired. Baltic States wanted wanted German tanks in Ukraine yesterday. They would, you know, I heard that Zelensky, this Ukraine president, uh, guy there, <laughs> he is it again the cross, you know, the Hitler's cross. You know, of course it's the sign for the army, if you will, but it's the same sign that the tanks, uh, you know, from Hitler had. But anyway, um, this Zelensky guy there, okay. Uh, was talks basically every day about uh, he every day uh, pleads or you know um, is saying oh USA or Germany you need to send tanks uh, to us you need to send tanks to us he says that every day man okay so it's not something like you know oh, oh this was once said and stuff no he said it every day okay or he says it every day Okay, but this will be a quick on point, you know, I don't want to go too long in, in it, so let's go into some other scripture real quick. Okay. Because this is all prophecy. Okay. Luke 21, 28. And when these things begin to come to pass, then look up and lift up your heads for your redemption toward now. Can't come, you see. Um, I can, you know, and then shall this they see the Son of Man coming in a cloud with power and click great glory. Okay, um. You see, and this even talks about um, fear or not, Isaiah 41 and 10. Okay, because uh, you know what were three, uh, or basically war in front of your door, you know, the moment where you set one foot of your, uh, out of your door, okay, you know, you have a tank rolling up, you know, or you have some, <laughs> some racket, okay, landing on your rooftop. Okay, you know, yeah, how will make it where that will not happen, you know, at least if he chose you. But, um, you know, uh, to have war before uh, in front or you know, in your guarding starting, starting is really, you know, Jacob's trouble basically, anyway. So, guess what? Isaiah 41, and the scripture even says that he gave us not the spirit of fear, but you should know that, you know. 
I say I have 41 in 10, fear not, uh, fear thou not, for I am with thee, be not dismayed, for I am thy God, I will strengthen thee. Okay, it will even come to the point of spiritual power for some. Okay, for some will, will be different, okay, but everyone, everybody has his lot and everybody has his beautiful end, if you will, okay. Because it's not a beautiful end to, you know, don't really knowing what, what you're dying for. And don't really knowing what this life was for and don't knowing how by Shemarashai and his power, okay. Scripture talks even about um, you should uh, be happy about uh, basically being in worst case scenario, okay, because of for uh, for being in it for Yahweh by Shemarashai. Yeah, I will help thee. Yeah, I will uphold thee with the right hand of my righteousness. Okay, and righteousness sounds good to the elect man. Okay, and guess what comes after righteousness? The kingdom man, and that is win-win situation for us. Okay, and righteousness for, uh, you know, us in the first place. Okay, because Yahweh will judge with uh, will judge us righteously. Okay, or right with righteousness. These other people, of course, also with righteousness, but not with a, um, without punishment. Okay, our sins will be forgiven. Theirs, not really. Okay, but with that, always you know some some time you know uh, of course you know what you know what I'm talking about, right? So all praises, you know, they will not be crowned. That's what I'm talking about. Um, so all praises to you.